Been a while since you came through town, ain't it? There's a little nook there if you need something for your camp. Looks like you travel a lot, so worth having a look and see. Ain't no other outfit beats their prices. That's mighty popular these days. I sell out of that pretty fast. Seem to have your eye on that. Those go pretty fast. That's mighty popular these days. You like the look of that one, huh? All right, have a think about it. Adam, I implore you to be sensible. Oh, I am being sensible. I swore I would kill them, each and every one of them. From the way I see it, I will do. I'm afraid my mind's made up. But Mrs. Leclerc, Teddy Brown, he's just a second-rate common no-good horse thief. You kill him and the rest of his boys, well, you'll wind up in jail, or worse. And we will never find out who killed your husband. You know it, and I know it. I believe Teddy Brown killed my husband. If he did so, he did it on behalf of his sister, her husband, or Jeremiah Shaw. Perhaps, Besides, but... he's holed up in there, besieged by marshals. Marshals? What good did a marshal ever do anyone? That's why we'll send in our professionals to get the job done, and no one will know you had anything to do with it. It's too early to show your hand, madam. Okay. You, come with me. And remember... These are the people that put you in jail. 
so don't overly concern yourself with pity. Madam, stay here. Please. Bastard is holed up, tight as he can be. I've already had two men shot since last we spoke. That's too bad. Luckily, I brought in the cavalry, so to speak. You have, huh? Yes. My associates. And what's more, I think I found a way of ensuring they don't get themselves shot. Like your deputies. Put those on. Teddy Brown is a bad man. One of the worst. But there's folk in Blackwater. Powerful folk. Who asked my boss to get me to leave him alone. I can imagine. Amos Lansing and Jeremiah Shaw, perhaps? Well, I don't know. Maybe. My lord! Look at you! I read about this. Australian, I believe. Always wanted to see if it works. Well, my friends, let me take you up. Come on. Bring us Teddy Brown. Dead or alive. You're an imbecile. A what? An idiot. I'm sorry. He said he wouldn't run away. Shut up. But please. But just please. shut up. They're going to fire me. Oh, you, you get to keep your job, but they'll fire me, and they've got every right to fire me, because I'm the idiot who employed you. Oh, look. Guests. <laughs> Are you a moron, partner? Huh? <laughs> Well, you can't be any worse than us, because this idiot, this idiot right here, just let the most notorious con man in the whole goddamn state walk clean out of a cell, clean out, and not a shot fired! Now, uh, if you get him back for us, we'll happily pay you. How about that? Good. Good. Now, see, what I figure is I figure he's headed on down to Pike's Basin, so you go down the canyon, and you get him, and I'm gonna beat this poor dumb bastard with a stick, and I'll try and join you on the other side. Mm -hmm. 